comic strip today and uh, you know what I saw in there? Peanuts. Ha has this comic strip ever been funny? I mean, they're not even trying anymore. It's just, it's, okay, here's my impression of, of the guys that I'm meeting. They're like, okay, well, let's have a dog and he's going to talk. That'll be great. <laughs> then uh, then uh, every time Charlie Brown gets hit with a pitch, he's like, he, all of his clothes fall off. He's naked then. <laughs> Why? Jeez, is Corey in my ear? We lost me. We lost me. Oh, weird. Technical adventures. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Well then, uh, Tom and Roseanne are—they're uh, gonna make a movie, and uh, Madonna's gonna be in it, and uh, I don't even have a joke for that. Just those guys. Okay, the president then. He's uh, a big, fat jerk. Just a dumb guy. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Well, we have a really great show for you tonight. Uh, we have, uh, we've flown in East China's favorite soccer player, uh, Dan Pop Pop Oxendorf. <laughs> that should be great. Uh, we'll uh, see a rap star. Well, he's not really a rap star, but uh, he's more of an uh, up-and-coming star. Uh, his name is Too Fat Fresh Made. <laughs> Ness. Too, too, fat, too Fat Freshness. The name, okay, the fresh. Okay, so uh, let's turn it over to Corey Swap One. The Corey Swap One, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> okay. How you doing, Andy? I'm all right. How was your weekend, Nord? Not too bad. How was yours, Andy? It really sucked. Oh, I, I tried to fix my own plumbing. Don't try this at home. Uh, have you ever fixed your own plumbing and then whined about it to a nation of millions? You will, and AT&T will bring it to you. <laughs> what? I, yeah. Yeah, what? So your weekend was better. Well, uh, yeah, I had a little backyard barbecue, and uh, the neighbor kids came over. We had ribs, and uh, everybody had lemonade, and we watched Goodfellas. I don't get it. Let's bring out Pop Pop. He's, uh, he's from China, you know. I don't care. Ladies and gentlemen, Pop Pop. <laughs> Shouldn't there, like, be an audience out there or something? Well... We, we have kind of an audience over here in SWAP. Ah. Corey? Corey. Woo! Hey, woo! <laughs> <laughs> All right. So uh, that's Corey, part of our uh, audience. Band playing with a script tonight. Band, uh, yeah. Okay, so uh, what's, your, what's your story? My story? Uh, okay, um, well, I was a kid, you know, an average kid, and I like to play soccer, but I wasn't, like, very good at it. And uh, so I really couldn't you know, break into the pros. <laughs> yeah, I couldn't break into the pros. Damn, you got a loud producer there. Uh, yeah, the, the uh, Morty's flying off the handle tonight. I think so. <laughs> okay. Uh, couldn't break into the pros. I've, uh, I've had that problem before. Really? Yeah, well, then I decided to do what I loved. I was going to have to go to China. To China? China. China, yeah, China. See, we, we here in the... Uh, in the TV writing world, don't have that option. It's either you write funny stuff or you, you starve. Well, there's always Fox. Very good point. Here, here, have a Scooby snack. What? <laughs> the hell? I, I have no idea. Conan? So I went to China then, sir, and uh, they, they didn't want to rush me on the team, right? Uh -huh. And uh, so I, I had a lot of bench time, a lot of bench hours. I, I know that bench well. Um, but I did finally get to play, and it was for the East Chinese team, who mm -hmm. did not go to the World Cup. 
Sadly enough, yes. Uh, bitch ain't going to the ball, so to speak. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Uh, we ended up playing pickup games with the uh, neighborhood girls. And uh, those, those East Chinese uh, eight-year-olds, hell on the shins. They kick you to death. Actually, my neighbor kids, uh, they kick my shins too, although I don't play soccer with them. They just come over while I'm sleeping and kick my legs. <laughs> so, do you miss it? Miss what? I, I don't know. I was hoping you did. Anyway, uh, you're very popular in China then? Yeah. <laughs> and, uh, doorbell and, uh, <laughs> I'll they, get they, it. They've got some, <laughs> that's a good one. You're funny, man. They have, like, this weird fascination with me. I'm on billboards and radio and wine bottles. I've even got my own line of explosives. Yeah, yeah, if we can get the uh, shot on that on uh, camera one there. Can we get that at, for one? It, can we, is that, can we see that? Can we, no, no. Is it there? It, does that work? Can you, like, just hold it, please. Is that it? Is, okay, can there. we get a shot of that? Is that, it, can we get, okay, oh, I've is that mind. it? Ooh. Pop, pop. Uh, yeah, so, uh, yeah. you put these in tea then? Yeah. Hello. Um, no, actually, you throw them in the ground and, and, they, and they go pop. Strange. So, uh, why do they call you Pop Pop? I don't know. Um, I really don't talk to anyone in China. They just pay me lots of money. That is weird. Uh, why is there a picture of a girl on the package? Well, they did actually try to explain this to me. Um, it appears that I'm a guy. Yeah. And uh, guys play soccer and watch soccer. That is right, dumbass. And uh, <laughs> producer's nuts. And guys play soccer and like soccer. And the uh, cruise. Somebody girls. put something in the cruise pudding tonight. Got <laughs> <laughs> guys play soccer and like soccer and uh, explosives and. Uh, so there's a girl on the on the front then. So that's an effort to balance it out then. Um. Yeah. Sure. Uh, I got a train. I gotta. I gotta take a train back to East China. The train to China? Yeah, it's leaving like two minutes. Two minutes. Well, you're gonna have to I, run if you want to get to I, China. I'm, so I'm gonna uh, have to. This God, this is insane. Pop, pop, Oxenorf, ladies and gentlemen. Back to. Uh, go back to Corey for a second. Do we have a shot of Corey for a? Swap, the Cory Swap one, all right. So, uh, Andy, what about that Pop Pop guy? Very sad story. I don't know why I'm not crying. Well, uh, that was very sad. Uh, is it because you don't have one emotion in your lifeless body? Well, it's better than always being uppity and bright. Yeah, y you gotta love that. Anyway, uh, let's bring out uh, Too Fat Fresh. Oh, hi, yeah, Too Fat. I'm already here. Yeah, I'm here. I don't know why. This sucks. Hey, too fat. You want to rap something? I can give you a funky beat. Actually, I'm not a rapper. A little, a little, uh, little Corey swap there for you. You uh, definitely have a street attitude. Uh, what brings you to New York? Well, here I'm supposed to be on some loser TV show hosted by some hot shot named Conan. Yeah, yeah, actually, I've heard of that show, but I uh, haven't had a chance to see it. See, the deal is I'm working when they tape that, so I never get out there. Early reports indicate it sucks. So, you're a new star in the rap scene. <laughs> no, actually, I'm not. If I ever got popular, I'd personally walk myself into caramel corn and, without remorse, strap 50 pounds of plastic explosives to my body. Fame actually isn't that bad. I uh, walk down the street every day, and nobody... Uh, bothers me for autographs or uh, even recognizes me, it's great. So, uh, you're a frustrated rap artist. Yeah, but I'm frustrated for really no reason at all. I still live with my parents and I'm pretty much doing okay in my book. What rap audience are you trying to target? Actually, I'm not trying to target any audience. That's why I came on your show. Well, worst of luck to you then. Do you uh, have your own line of noisemakers? Are you amused by Andy at all? Do you find talking dogs or naked cartoon baseball pitchers funny? Do you want to hear a joke about the president? If I wash your car, will you give me a dollar? Uh, would you like some eggs? Ever watch Seinfeld? Like playing darts? Uh, ever think about killing Bill Cosby? Just to chew gum a lot? Ever bought nylons before? 
Uh, do you want to arm wrestle with Andy? Can, uh, can you speak Spanish? Uh, do you find the presence of Cory Swap ir irritating but slightly beneficial? Well, actually, I like the Cory Swap one. It is irritating but yet humorous. Wow, I uh, could have been there for a long time. I gotta go. I'm gone. I'm out of here. Friendly guy. I wanted to arm wrestle. Okay, uh, we're pretty much out of time, so join us tomorrow when my um, guest will be nine-year-old neighbor kid Helmut Kenner and uh, TV star Phil Hartman.